How's it going everyone? My name is Zero Matter, hosting the Zero Matter Experiment. So this comes as a bit of a breaking news sort of thing. Also keep in mind some of the info here should be taken with a grain of salt, as I'm sure things can change at any given time. Okay, so the leaked info should look similar to Ninjala veterans who have been around since day one. The Jujutsu Kaisen collaboration event will see outfits and emotes from the anime series added to the video game based on characters from the series like Yuji Itadori, Satoru Gojo, and more. And it starts on March 10th. This is always fun news as many players look forward to getting new outfits and especially emotes. Not to mention, we also have a start date as well. Now, how many outfits are we getting for this collab? Again, take all info with a grain of salt. But according to the leaked info, there will be 12 new outfits from the anime. Ninjala players will also be able to grab costumes from Ryomin Sakuna, Suguru Geto from a special collaboration Gum Gacha. There are also new emotes that are modeled after attacks from Jujutsu Kaisen. A special Jujutsu Kaisen Cup will also be held on April 9th, and the top 4,000 players will get a rare emote. The Jujutsu Kaisen Cup is a tournament for those that didn't know, and tournaments are normally held on Saturdays very late during the day. Also, if you plan on getting the rare emote, you must be in the top 4,000 to obtain the emote, at least according to the leaks. Leaked info aside, one thing I will mention is I'm a little concerned about this collab starting so early in the season. Who knows, maybe Ninjala slash Gung Ho have more up their sleeve. We shall see. So what did you guys think of the latest leaked information coming out of Ninjala in regards to the collaboration? You guys excited? You guys hyped? Leave all the comments down in the comment section below. Well, that's all the time I have, and I will see you all on the next one.